I made a Pokemon quiz with ridiculous questions where correct answers award costumes and props. With a Pokemon contest at the end, which of these YouTubers will reign supreme? All right, guys, your categories are Fake Mon. What are they doing? Frankenmon, Pokestars, Minigames, and Riddles. Like always, Peter, you're up first. What are they doing for Pokeball? What is she doing? Oh, no. Barbados. I don't what, know. What? Pass. <laughs> okay. Uh, Shep, do you know? I do. Um, I'm pretty sure that like trainer class is beauty. So I think this is beauty fly. <laughs> beauty fly. <laughs> yep. Shep, you get the prize. Consolation was for if nobody got it. You get Professor Oak. Wow. Oh, that's no. a prop. <laughs> <laughs> this is up to you to decide. You can do whatever you want with Oak. Whoa. Uh, whoa. Oh, oh my. <laughs> uh, let's do Frankenmon for Ultra Ball. What part doesn't belong on this Pokemon? Oh, jeez. <laughs> this, this is giving um, the last of us currently. <laughs> well, I'm pretty sure those eyes are Bellsprout's mouth. My God, you've got it. It is Bellsprout's mouth. I was going to say Miltank's butthole. <laughs> <laughs> For that, you win determination. Oh, boy, am I. You could make that come out of Oak's backside. <laughs> yeah, Shep, I think yours is done. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm Yeah, you I'm don't set. need any more props. Fake Mon for Great Ball. Starting right at the beginning, which shiny is fake? I feel like it's Trico. Trico feels a little off to me. I don't think he's that blue. He is not that blue. Let's go! And you win a ladle. Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly what I wanted. Much more excited than Shep was about Professor Oak. I gotta know what Pokey Stars is. <laughs> what movie is this Wismer starring in? What? <laughs> Christopher Walken? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's it's a movie. Oh, is it A Quiet Place Part 1? It is A Quiet Place. Hooray. Christopher Walken? <laughs> I don't know who the kid was. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you win a wig. Oh, sick. I'll put that on myself. Let's go with our first mini games for Pokeball. Ooh. Okay, so this is a word search. You had to find the Pokemon hidden amongst the letters. And this is for all of you. Search. Oh, I thought it was a different one. It's the unknown T. <laughs> okay, well, Peter, you're the first one who buzzed in. Unknown T. <laughs> you're right. Thank you. Uh, Peter, you win shimmering fire. My hair. <laughs> oh, no, his hair. Someone put him out. Give me a riddle, me thinks, for a, a ball of pokey me drink. I just click it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, which Pokemon do these trainers use? Mime Jr. <laughs> no, no Mime Jr. <laughs> I hate that one. Which one picked it? Uh, Drake. Of course. Why, why do you think he's sitting on nothing? The Mime <laughs> Jr. mimed a little box for him to sit on. Why not? Because why not like us? Why not like it? No? No. <laughs> I knew uh, it was Shep. bad, but I figured these were bad. I'll go with Toxtricity. He's, uh, <laughs> they said that milk tank of Buffalon because they have beef. Why <laughs> did I think that for half a second? <sighs> All right, so no one gets the prize. Uh, but Chris, I'm going to give you the consolation. <laughs> For and you win a thick book. <laughs> no, I didn't get Whoa. the gun! <laughs> Could we go Frankenmon Quick Ball? You may. Which part doesn't belong on this Pokemon? Oh my gosh, it's the little thingy nails. Okay, but who does it belong to? It just says which part doesn't belong, Shannon. I don't have to answer that. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh if you want the props, you do. Uh, uh, bar barbicle? Barbarical. It is not <laughs> barbarical. Oh, gosh. Uh, Shep. Those are the top of a uh, binnacle, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> yes, that is specifically binnacle. You win a spotlight. Oh, that would The nice. spotlight is on oak. You could make that come out of his backside, too. <laughs> what are they doing? Timer ball. What is he doing? Looks, looks like a roundhouse kick. And another term for a roundhouse would be a hamster ball. And the most hamster like Pokemon is more Pico, so more Pico. No. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, he hit him on top. That's good, uh, but not correct. Peter, bring it home. Throw. <laughs> Unfortunately, he caught a knee. Oh. <laughs> That's actually pretty good. Chris, you gain a clown nose. Uh, honestly, Damn Ash's it. mom would just make me uh, a little uncomfortable to start dressing up. Clown nose, though, I'm stoked. I will do Frankenmon for Great Ball. Which part doesn't belong? Ah! Okay. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um, what? The guy was just hanging brain. I mean, what's all the fuss? I'm going to say Lilip. 
It's Lilip on the udders. It is Lilip's tentacles. Oh, they look like dicks. <laughs> no way. I'm never going to unsee that. No, this is just what happens when you milk a milk tank too much. Uh-huh. <laughs> please, please remove this from the screen. <laughs> it's sore. Uh, Chris, you get a big tree. <laughs> <laughs> what am I gonna do with this? <laughs> Just stick a ladle in it. I don't know. <laughs> a ladle of a cloud. Oh my goodness. Let's go for Riddles Timer Ball. What's the first Pokemon in the Pokedex? Alphabetically or numerically? What is the first Pokemon in the Pokedex? Um, I'm just gonna go National Dex Bulbasaur. It is not Bulbasaur. <clears throat> is it? Your starter, because that would be the first one that would be registered in the Pokedex. The first Pokemon in the Pokedex is Rotom. Oh, it's no other Pokemon has gone inside it before. That's All right, good. Yeah, that was no, a, that's good. That's a good that's one. A good one. For being smart, Shep, you can have a magic wand. Oak Ooh. the wizard. That now where could that go as well? Let's think about it for just a second here. <laughs> this is gonna be just a challenge of how many things can I shove up there. <laughs> It's just going to be Oak standing there and Shannon's going to be like, where's the props? And you'd be like, you know. <laughs> you make the background a doctor's office. Oh, God. <laughs> I don't know how they got up there. <laughs> All right, let's go Fake Mon Ultra Ball. <gasps> Finger stuck in my pants. I mean, like, like <laughs> what? Not, <laughs> the rope. You almost made me spit water on my computer screen. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, left the call. <laughs> Which mega Pokemon is fake? Ooh, that's a... Okay, wait. <laughs> Pretty sure it's Kangaskhan because it doesn't have a new baby comeback. <laughs> yeah, Kangaskhan doesn't gain another baby. That's a, that's a busy Kangaskhan. You pluck one out, another just pops right up. <laughs> like a Pez dispenser. You win a straw hat. All right. What are they doing for Ultra Ball? What is she doing? Hmm... She tangle her. <laughs> she do not tangle her. She hairy um, her chin? Hairy um, hairy um, I don't know. <laughs> no. She's cosplaying Greninja. She, her hair across. Mm. Oh, damn. Yeah. All right, Peter, you get the consolation prize of a purple fedora. Oh, no. Now my wig is going to be covered up. How many people did you make props? Yeah, where are the Pokemon? <laughs> <laughs> you got to find them. Pokestars, great ball. Pretty sure that's already been done. Yes, I know I know the answer to it. What uh, would you really like? Pokestar Timer Ball. What movie is this? What movie does Mouse Oh start? my god, I know this. Oh, is it one of those like Fival Adventure ones? Because they were all mice in that, right? Uh, no. Is it 101 Dalmatians? It is 101 Dalmatians. I think it's time for another mini game. Let's go for Ultra Ball. This is called Streaming Stampede. You guys are going to count the number of Pokemon that pass by. Ah, oh, jeez. Oh, okay. God. Three, two, one, go. Wah! Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I don't have a clue. Easy. Easy! Okay, Peter, how many Pokemon do you think it was? 31. Okay, Shep, what do you think? I'm actually going to say 41. And Chris? 40. 40. Okay, so this was 35 Pokemon. Closest without going over. Let's go. So... For this, there are three Pokemon, and you guys get to choose which ones you take. So, Peter, you were the closest with 31, so you get the first choice. I gotta go with Wooper. Chris, you're in second. What would you like? The snail. Shep, you get a Bidoof. Just as planned. I'm feeling like that was a fun one. I want to do mini game for Quick Ball. Okay, this is a word search number two. Three, two, one. Search. <laughs> I see Ekans written in the middle. I didn't fool you with the Squirtle. <laughs> nope. Wow, I, I fully was ready to say Wekans. <laughs> Wekans. <laughs> I would like mini games for a great ball. So where's Why Not? There are two Why Not hidden in the following slide. Find them. Buzz. Bu oh. Yes. Uh, behind, yep. the, behind the pole vaulters. Yep, that's one. Eh. Chris. There's shot put. <laughs> Buy the shot put. All right, Shep, you get first choice this time. I'm going to take Mankey. I feel like my goopy little slug snail needs arms. I'm going to get a Geodude. Dude, and that means, Peter, you get a C-Dot. He's going to look so good in a wig. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go for a, 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 a wild one. Let's go Frankenmon for Master Ball. Which part doesn't belong on this Pokemon? Oh, I got that immediately. That is Gossifleur's Flower. It is Gossifleur's Flower. Damn, dude. Good eye. And you win a Stump. <laughs> stump. <laughs> What have you done to Trevenant? 
I feel like nobody's touching Poke Stars, and I'm nervous to touch Poke Stars. But let's do uh, Poke Stars for Poke Ball. What show are these guys starring in? Let me, let me get a close inspection of this. This looks like a painted background, so it could be an animation. Jimmy Neutron. <laughs> it's not Jimmy Neutron. Um, is it the the Last of Us? It is not the Last of Us. I I don't know the Iron Giant. <laughs> This is Full Metal Alchemist. <laughs> yeah, that's good. That's good. Small angry and then big metal guy. <laughs> I gotta get rid of this like single dangling Pokeball here. Frankenmon. What part doesn't belong on this Pokemon? Oh, that's uh, Meow's little head coin. Absolutely it is. Hooray. Uh, you win Puffy Smoke. Oh, hell yeah. If Oak, if Oak had this, <laughs> it could go anywhere. What are they doing? For quick ball. What is he doing? It's almost too obvious. I'm going to say something wild. Cough egregious because he's coughing and that sweater is egregious. My God, shit. No, no way. <laughs> that was crazy. I was going to say he glaring and wheezing. <laughs> I am stunned right now. I am stunned. And you know what? Because, uh, because Chris, you you threw that in. And that's really funny. I'm going to give you the consolation. No, I should have just started riffing. <laughs> <laughs> So, Shep, you get Professor Birch? Yes! <laughs> Look at the pose. <laughs> oh, it was meant to be. So much You're going to gonna put Professor out. Oak right up there. <laughs> Oak's going to be wearing Birch like a hat. <laughs> I want that Ultra Ball with the pimple on it, no matter what it is. Okay. How many trainers does it take to change a tad bulb? Oh, no. Uh, one, I don't know. <laughs> no. What? Well, I thought one was clearly going to be the answer. Okay, how many trainers? Two? No, it's not two. I'm going to say zero because you can't make a Todd Bulb change. It'll change on its own if it wants to. None. It takes a Thunderstone. Yuck. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Peter. Uh, I'm going to give the consolation to both Shep and Chris. What? <laughs> so you can both have a fluffy bed. Look, I oh. did it. Shit, did that. Oak and Birch are going to have a great time. And also Mankey. Oh yeah, I forgot I have Pokemon. <laughs> Leave them out of this. What are they doing, Great Ball? What is she doing? She she meet she met Ang? Met, met Ang? She meet Ang? She met Ang. Yes. Nice. <laughs> you win a Lickitung. Nice. Oh, snap. You know, this fake mon category is pretty neglected. Let's do, uh, let's do Timer Ball. Which gym leader is real? What did you? Switching it up a little bit. Okay. <laughs> it's not Drayden, because the hair and beard, not right. That's Silen, which means it's green hair, but he has blue hair, so not real. And then you gave Milo a nose. <laughs> so the real one's Clay. Oh, you know he the realist. You win a green barrette. Ooh. Kira, I'm going to do Frankenmon and lock it out. Which part doesn't belong on this Pokemon? Is that... Oh, what's the Pokemon's name? What's its name? What's its name? What's its name? Greg. Uh, Greg, is that Greg? <laughs> no, uh, 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 what's that mongoose? He's a detective. He's got the same name as the character in Ace Attorney. Miss it, come on, Chris, uh, Chris miss it, I've got I this. It. It's the, uh, I might have to take an L, I can't think of the name. Okay, it is not nothing, Peter. It is Gumshoes. Damn it! Oh my god, that was a- <laughs> It's not Gumshoes. What? No! <laughs> That's embarrassing. It was a trick. It was a ploy. It was a ploy to get Peter uh, wrong. Is that Drowsy's trunk? Oh, Guys, my you're letting Shep throw you get. off here. It is Drowsy's nose. I, I hate it. Oh, <laughs> Peter's like, that's gumshoes. Just to <laughs> then completely whip. Oh, uh, Shep. You get a frilly apron. Oh, uh -huh. yeah. Holy shit. You know what? You, you deserve that. Let's go with fake mon for a master ball. But first, if you've been enjoying this video so far, make sure to subscribe for more Pokemon nonsense. We'd really appreciate it. Which shiny is fake? So I'm pretty sure Mewtwo's good. Let's go with Buzzwool. You got it, Buzzwool is green. And you win a black tie. Yes. If this is a formal event, you guys are all screwed. Leo, you know, let's go with the category I've been avoiding. Um, Pokestars, quick ball. What show is this from? <laughs> oh my god. That's funny. That's good. This is The Office. <laughs> this is the Pokemon's version of The Office. And you win a white pom pom. I'm going to go mini game timer ball. Okay. Spot the differences. So all three of you are going to take part. 
You're gonna find as many differences between the next two pictures as you can, and you have 20 seconds. Go! And time. Oh no. All right, with 10, Chris, you win. Shep with eight, you're in second. And Peter with You don't need to say four. my number, that's fine. Okay. <laughs> Chris, you get to choose first. I'm gonna take Stunky. I will definitely be taking Gloom. Shannon, can I get riddles for that absolutely normal, nothing wrong with it quick ball? <laughs> yes, you can. This Pokemon celebrity hybrid has landed many huge roles in big budget films lately, such as Dune and Wonka. But who could blame him for being attracted to the spotlight? I don't know, Butterfree? Not Butterfree. Peter has convinced me that it might be a bug Pokemon. I'm going to go with Timothy Chalamet. That was my answer. God damn it. <laughs> it is Timothy Chalamet. Damn. <laughs> Shep, so you get the prize because you got it right, but Peter, I'm going to give you the consolation because you helped. Let's go. Let's go. Pokestars Master Ball. Which movie is Goldine starring in? Oh, gosh. Um, is this Ponyo? That is Ponyo. Nice. And you win a decorative ribbon. I'm going to do what do the dog doing for Master Ball? What are you doing? What? Oh, my God. That's genius. What do you mean? What do you mean? It's genius. <laughs> so good. <laughs> And it's a Pokemon? <laughs> oh my, I just got it. Dotler? Uh, <laughs> Not I mean, Dotler. Peter? You see Dot? You are seeing a Dot. You see that. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> For a second, I was like, he would not put Wishmer's butthole on this slide, would he? <laughs> <laughs> Peter, you win a Shellgun. Nice. Would have loved that lace cap. Yeah, I was just going to say, can I have that cap too? <laughs> you know what? Hey, you can have the cap, Peter. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> mm, I got to close out Fake Mon with a quick ball. Which shiny is fake? Is it Electabuzz? It is not Electabuzz. Oh, darn. I think it's horsey. It is horsey. <laughs> Somebody's a little Oh, you horsey. completely inverted the image. Oh, that's really good. <laughs> dying. <laughs> My throat's a little horsey. <laughs> like how Shannon's just like actually dying and we're like, oh yeah, that's really good, Shannon. <laughs> <laughs> Shep, you win a mustache. No. Yes. Focus stars, Ultra Ball. Which show are these guys starring in? One of my favorites, Naruto. This is Naruto. I'm gonna be honest with you, Shannon. I'm, like, I'm guessing these purely from the scenery and not the Pokemon. <laughs> what do you mean? The edgy purple guy versus the round yellow guy isn't enough for you? What makes Naruto round? His personality. Good answer. You get a shuriken. Hell yeah. <laughs> do not put that in oak. <laughs> I'm a big baby, so I'm gonna go riddles for Great Ball. I wanted that. Who's that Pokemon? Okay, cannot be beware. It just simply cannot be beware. Well, actually, if you turn it upside down, it does look like beware. I don't know if you noticed that. Oh, wait. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> is it beware upside down? It is Australian beware. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you win an egg. All right, Peter, your last category. Mm, I want to see that mini game for a master ball. How many words can you make from a Pokemon? You have 15 seconds, and this is for all of you. Go. Uh, uh. So you're making as many words as you can from Celesteela. Your time is half up. Already? And time. <laughs> I <laughs> didn't have words anything. <laughs> you didn't get any words? I got three, but that's not a lot. I was about to say, Peter, steel is right there. A. <laughs> Just the <laughs> letter A. <laughs> get wreck nerds. <laughs> and two of your words are the same thing. Just spell different. <laughs> now with a whopping nine, we have Shep. You get to choose first. Oh, God. As much as I want that pseudo wudo, I think I'm going to go Incineroar. I don't want anything to do in my image with Gardevoir or Incineroar. I want pseudo wudo. Hmm. All right, well, Peter, I'm sorry, but you're stuck with Gardevoir. I see. Well, I really only have, uh, have Riddle's Master Ball. Who's that Pokemon? Ooh, deep. Uh, okay, big brain play here. It's Clefairy. It is not Clefairy. <clears throat> Chris. Because uh, what could this be? For some say, reason, my... <laughs> it's Typhlosion with no go ahead just give me the X just give me the no okay <laughs> Peter it's Pikachu you guys don't trust me very much it's Pikachu yeah <laughs> damn it Peter you get Machamp let's go <laughs> what is... and Chris you get Eerie Thing what is Eerie Thing <laughs> that's its official name alright Chris you're up just... we just finished no, nope, there's still one ball on the board. What? Hang on. I don't get it. Let me get my glasses. We forgot fake mon for Pokeball. What? What? Ow. How did we miss that? All right, guys, that's enough. We, we beat this bit into the ground. All right, give me give me fake mon for Pokeball then. I'm about to crush this. 
I don't see it, but you can ask for it, you know? Oh! <laughs> um, the whole question was fake. Incredible. Um, Wait, I know this one. <laughs> oh, what is it? It's Trico, dude. The Trico's fake. It's Trico. Oh my you God. win a ladle. I got two <laughs> ladles, baby. That's all I needed. That's all I wanted. Okay, guys, now that the quiz is over, here's how the Pokemon contest is going to work. So you're all going to create a scene using your props. You can use as many of each as you'd like. You can change their shape, their color, their rotation, whatever you want. You can also use any background you want. So you'll each have 20 seconds to explain your masterpiece, and our lovely viewers will decide the winner in the comments. Okay, so often when I'm faced with an artistic endeavor, my mind goes to Bob Ross. Uh, so that's what I did, a Bob Ross. Although I received several items, they were entirely unnecessary. As you can see, Machamp has perfectly, painstakingly recreated one of Bob's most famous paintings using only these happy little wigs. This act pays homage to one of the best afros to ever do it. Also Bob Ross. The masterpiece in front of you is Professor Birch traveling to Oak's lab for a friendly visit, only to stumble upon Oak's new experimental research on Pokemon breeding. Also, yes, Birch has a Bidoof up his ass. So this is a bit of a personal piece of mine. It's uh, certainly something I've wanted to have framed in my own home. I call it Jeff Goldblum getting hit by a cold wave and he doesn't like it. it there's actually a reference photo that I've attached here as well. It's a real photo. I enjoy. Thank you. And those are your choices. Vote to decide the winner by liking a competitor's post underneath my pinned comment. Their fates are in your hands. Thank you for watching, and subscribe for more ridiculous Pokemon videos.